Hey everyone! Tired of those annoying ads interrupting your Spotify vibes? What if I told you that you could make Spotify completely ad-free and even give it a custom look that matches your style? In this video, I'll show you how to do just that, whether you're on Windows, Mac OS, or Linux, no premium required, and totally safe. It's easier than you think, and you'll be up and running in minutes. Let's jump straight into it. First, make sure that Spotify is not installed from the Microsoft Store. To check that, simply open the Microsoft Store. Next, search for Spotify in the Microsoft Store. If you see an open button, that means it's the Microsoft Store version, and you'll need to uninstall it. To uninstall it, go to your system settings. Then, navigate to Apps, and click on Installed Apps. From there, search for Spotify, click on the three dots on the right, and select Uninstall. After uninstalling, open your browser and head over to the official Spotify website by searching Spotify Download on Google or going directly to Spotify.com. Make sure to download the desktop version from there, not the Microsoft Store. This version is important because it's fully compatible with the tweaks and customizations we'll be using later in the video. Once the download is complete, install Spotify like you normally would, then go ahead and log into your account. Next, go back to your browser and search for Spicetify. This is the tool we'll be using to customize Spotify and remove ads. Click on the Install button, and you'll see that Spicetify supports Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. Just copy the installation command that matches your operating system. Now, search for Windows PowerShell in the Start menu and open it. Once it's open, paste the command you copied from the Spicetify website and press Enter. This will begin installing Spicetify on your system. During the installation, it might ask if you want to install the Spicetify Marketplace. When that prompt appears, just type Y and press Enter to continue. Once the installation is complete, you'll need to close Spotify completely and then reopen it for the changes to take effect. Now, you'll notice a new Marketplace icon at the top of the Spotify window. Just click on it to explore available extensions and themes. Next, go to the Extensions tab inside the Marketplace and search for Adblockify. Once you find it, click on Install and then click the Reload button to activate it in Spotify. Then, navigate back to the Marketplace and click on the Themes tab. Here, you'll find a variety of custom themes to completely change the look and feel of your Spotify. Take your time browsing, and once you find a theme that matches your style, just click Install to apply it. You'll instantly notice how much better this theme looks compared to the default one. It's cleaner, more personalized, and just overall way cooler. Now, head over to the Snippets tab. Here you'll find a bunch of additional features and visual tweaks. For example, I'm going to try out the Rounded Images snippet to give Spotify a softer, more modern look. As you can see, the corners of the song covers are now nicely rounded, giving the interface a cleaner and more modern appearance. Now, if you go to the Apps tab, you'll find a lot of useful features that can enhance your overall Spotify experience even further. You can also change the style of the themes under the Themes tab to better match your preference.
Now, let me show you how to uninstall these tweaks in a simple and easy way. To do that, just navigate to the Uninstall section on the Spicetify website. From there, simply copy the uninstallation command provided for your operating system. Then, open Windows PowerShell and paste the command you just copied. You might see a warning message. Just click on Paste Anyway to proceed. And that's it. The uninstallation will complete automatically. As you can see, the Marketplace button is no longer visible in Spotify, confirming that everything has been successfully uninstalled. And that's it. Now you know how to remove ads and give Spotify a fresh new look. If this helped, give it a like and consider subscribing for more cool tech tips. Got questions? Drop them in the comments. I've got you covered. See you in the next one.